Good medical morning. This is Watson, your subject matter expert, and today we're consulting with the CDC to learn more about the coronavirus. Stick around so you learn symptoms, treatment, diagnosis, and possible origin. Let's kick it off right about now. Starting with the symptoms, coronaviruses are a large family of viruses that usually infect animals, but can sometimes evolve and spread to humans. Symptoms include fever, coughing, and shortness of breath, which can progress to pneumonia. Other symptoms include runny nose, headache, cough, sore throat, fever, and a general feeling of being unwell. It's recently made the news in the U.S. as there are dozens of patients under investigation for the condition. Carl, the CDC is confirming a second patient who had traveled to Wuhan, China, has been confirmed uh, with the novel coronavirus. She is a woman in her 60s, a resident of Chicago. She returned to the country on January 13th, and the CDC says she traveled before she was symptomatic. They say the risk to the general public nationally and in Chicago uh, is low. A spokesperson said, quote, CDC believes the immediate risk to the U.S. public is low at this time but the situation continues to evolve rapidly. Adding that there is likely to be more cases in coming days and that, quote, we have our best people working on this problem, end quote. The flu-like coronavirus first identified on December 31st has killed at least 26 people in China and infected more than 900 worldwide. So how is it diagnosed? Your healthcare provider may order laboratory tests on respiratory specimens and serum to detect human coronaviruses. Laboratory testing is more likely to be used if you have severe disease or are suspected of having MERS, or Middle East Respiratory Syndrome. If you're experiencing symptoms, you should tell your healthcare provider about any recent travel or contact with animals. Most MERS infections have been reported from countries in the Arabian Peninsula Therefore, reporting a travel history or contact with camels or camel products is very important when trying to diagnose MERS. How concerned should we be? Well, I don't think that this is a high risk right now for the American public, and the American public should not be worried, as it were, or frightened. But this is something we absolutely need to take seriously. Regarding the origin of coronavirus, experts have confirmed that the deadly outbreak began at a wholesale animal market in the Chinese city of Wuhan. Scientists with the CDC said tests show the pneumonia-like virus initially jumped from animals to humans at a seafood wholesales market that is now shut down. It sold live animals including wolf pups, foxes, rats, and peacocks. The CDC said, quote, 31 of the 33 positive samples were collected from the western zone of the market where booths of wildlife trading concentrated. The results suggest that the novel coronavirus outbreak is highly relevant to the trading of wild animals." End quote. Physicians have compared the outbreak to the 2003 outbreak of SARS, which had a short incubation period of two to seven days. U.S. officials said Friday that symptoms from the new virus, temporarily named 2019 NCOV, may take up to 14 days to appear. And at this point, it's unclear how contagious the virus is during the incubation period before symptoms appear. So leave a comment below. Will this be a major problem in the coming years in your country? Let us know where you're from and how you're reacting. Also, hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications so you can see all of our updates. Thanks for watching. All right, Jesse, what do you think of rest more? Rest more, I was a little s kind of skeptic in the beginning, but I've been taking it for about a month now. I uh, definitely fall asleep uh, really easy, but the cool thing is I wake up refreshed, don't feel groggy in the mornings, I'm able to work out, run like I normally do, but I stay sound asleep uh, for a good eight hours every night. Awesome, thank you. Rest more is an essential addition to your medicine cabinet for those times you need to fall asleep but can't. Remember, when you just need more rest, get rest more. Now available on Amazon. Good night.